what is up you guys what's up youtube so as you guys can see we are in the car that is because we are getting ready to head to the emergency clinic y'all jose all the rest of his wounds are healing perfectly fine except the one um my left arm right arm yeah my, except my left left arm top right arm yeah and my butt cheek yeah so they're playing the wound we, sympathy yeah we pain. are about to head to the emergency clinic because it don't look good i will try to insert a picture but it's really nasty so i don't know if i should insert the picture or not because i did take a picture but yeah y'all we have to go and see and make sure that it's not infected fingers crossed that it's not infected y'all and that it's healing properly we did um jose ended up getting in the shower and i did like run like some soap through it like soap and water to try to like rinse it out but y'all we don't know if you know that it's too late jose did like soak in like a bathtub the other day as well but for some reason this one just it's not looking good y'all so the thing is yeah it's rotten and covered in the hook yeah so we are unsure if that's how it's supposed to look or you know if it's infected or not so that's what we're getting ready to do so i'm about to look for his discharge because i think i left it in the car y'all and see if they listed clinics on there that we can actually go to and then we're going to head to one and hopefully y'all they can give him like a little bit more pain medication because this particular wound has been keeping this man up, up all night all night and all morning and so we literally have not been getting no sleep in the house no y'all no healing mm, yeah so it's like this one little mm, y'all it's making me so mad because everything is doing so good but it's Ugh. this one like why why so anyways y'all i'm gonna quit rambling i'm about to look for his discharge papers and see what information they have in there for us as far as clinic goes and we're about to head out so let me do that real quick and then we'll be right back i found his discharge papers right here i'm about to look I looked at them before we left the hospital, but you know how like you just kind of glance at something, you don't fully read it until like you need it, and now I need it, so. They only put like the trauma, um, the trauma number on here for like any concerns or anything like that. Okay, so we're just about to go to the clinic. They didn't list one on here, y'all, so we'll go to the clinic and see what the clinics say, and then we'll just go from there, so. y'all so we have made it to the clinic we are waiting for the doctor to come in and let us know whether everything is going to be okay with those days wounds. they're going to have to come in here and remove his clothing which he's going to be in a lot of pain when they do that but um fingers crossed y'all hopefully everything gets okay and it's not infected i think they're going to end up giving him the same medicine that he had um when we got discharged from the hospital hopefully i'm just hoping everything is okay y'all because all the rest of his wounds look pretty good except this one so there he is Y'all, he's in a lot of pain today, so I'm glad that I didn't have to work today and that I'm actually home. I feel like we should have came probably like a couple of days sooner, but honestly, it wasn't looking as bad as it looked today. And like I said, we did get in the shower and rinse it and stuff, but I don't know, y'all. It just, it looks weird, but I just pray it's nothing serious. I don't want my baby to lose his booty cheek. But yeah, he's been doing like some breathing techniques you know, to kind of help ease him through the pain i feel bad you know like sometimes how you just be feeling you wish you can just take that person's pain away so that you can be at ease you know i don't know but yeah you know, it's been a it's been a crazy morning but once again we have little to no sleep i'll give you guys an update when we leave we are leaving the clinic in bad news what i did not want to hear what i absolutely did not want to hear y'all jose wounds are infected so he have three wounds that are covered in infected up. they ended up swabbing um one of the wounds to send it off to the lab to make sure that it's nothing bad fingers crossed on that y'all but yeah they ended up um giving him a prescription two um prescriptions for antibiotic and then one for the pain medication that he was on before so we have to go pick that up within the next 30 minutes to an hour <laughs> so i'm about to go give me something to eat y'all but i am just like i'm just so freaking stressed out because i wish that 
it didn't get to this point if Jose would have just let me, you know, rinse the wounds with I water and soap, Maybe I was like out they of said. Pain medication. But yeah, he ran out of pain medication, so I was unable to rinse the wounds with water and soap, like they said to do daily. Because any little pain Jose felt, y'all, he wanted to take his pain medication because he hates pain. And now is the time that we really need it. And yeah, so now we have to go pick up a whole nother prescription, and oh. it's just. Oh, you guys. Oh. Oh. So that is where we is at, y'all. Jose wounds are oh. officially infected. rotted and covered in up. Yep. So this is why he's been in so much pain. I wish I would have came sooner, but honestly, it really didn't look this bad until now. So. Oh. Yeah, y'all. We're about to go head home, and then we're gonna go pick up his prescription. So right at the pharmacy. So I think in five days, cause all this healed in five days. Yeah. So as long as I'm gonna take my medication and take a shower, this should heal in five days and have five days with medication. So I should be good within five days. So right now, we're still waiting on the prescriptions. Come on, babe. Go. Oh, there you go. There's these Doritos that I wanna try. They're called Sriracha Doritos and I'm about to see if they have them here Dude, while we wait. Hot. Sriracha? Yeah. Is it like flavor hot or hot hot? I don't know, but I want to try them because I know that we had them at my store. And they also have a Carolina Reaper Hot Cheeto now, if y'all didn't know. These are the new Hot Cheetos. I wonder if they're oh, good, Oh, that's though. stupid hot. That's it, pro <laughs> it probably is. They don't got the Doritos, though. And guess what? They got a Mexican corn Cheeto, too. But they don't have that one here, either. Ooh, Frito Chili Cheese? What? That lucky sound good. We have made it back home. We did go do a little bit of grocery shopping. We got Jose's prescription. I'm about to give him um, his other antibiotics. So we gave him a pain pill and um, one of his antibiotics when uh, we left the pharmacy. So now I'm about to give him his um, other antibiotic. So he took this one and he took his pain pill right here. And then they also gave him these creams. So he got that. And then they told us that he has to um, well, he don't have to, but it's probably good if he do drink like a probiotic with the antibiotics because it kind of helps clear like out the bacteria. Like I said, I don't know if I mentioned earlier that they did swab his uh, wounds to send off to the lab. I probably did. So we have to go back there next week to do like a follow up and make sure like, you know, like it's nothing crazy um, with his wounds. And we got him one of these yogurts. So I'm about to give him this antibiotic. Cause she told us to wait like 30 minutes in between each bit each antibiotic to make sure that he doesn't have like a, some type of allergic reaction y'all so that is what i'm about to do and i'm also about to run him a bath y'all so that he can soak in the tub because now that he has a pain pill he shouldn't be in as much pain yeah we're gonna do that and then uh, i'm about to cook while he take his bath y'all i took out some um i took this out oh I took this out, obviously it's way done thawing because I took it out just morning. And we kind of been gone all day from the house. So I'm about to make that with some rice. Y'all, I'm super excited because they got a freaking Hocus Pocus 2 that is about to be dropping on Disney Plus September 30th, y'all. Babe, I wonder if this is good. This is the kind he said he wanted, y'all. He wanted the strawberry one. Mmm, babe, it's good. It don't got chunkies in it either. Y'all, Jose be screaming in this house literally like all day and i feel like the neighbors probably think like i'm in here like doing like some freaky stuff like crazy stuff to him or something you know jose has on no clothes y'all so i'm gonna be back after i give him his um antibiotic and his uh yogurt thing yeah. jose is taken care of he's in the tub taking his bath y'all i'm about to cook actually got my rice pot out so i'm about to make my rice I'm gonna go ahead and end out this vlog it's been a long a long day y'all so hope you guys enjoyed the video if you made it to the end please be sure to leave us a thumbs up if you're new to the channel and you haven't subscribed yet please make sure you hit the subscribe button down below do not forget to click that post notification bell so y'all don't miss when we upload on the channel and we'll see you guys in our next video peace You want to race? You said what? You want to race? Let's do yeah, it. Come on. You want to race? Come on.
Agua, eh.